everybody, Space B once again, finally back with some sunless sea. It's been a while since I do since I've done this um, where to start. Um, I can't think of where to start. Basically, internet troubles meant that if I was uploading, that's all that I was doing all day. I couldn't do anything else, I couldn't watch videos or anything, so I didn't want to like, cut myself off from basically doing something during the day. So, that's why I stopped for a while, and then I just had no motivation to do that. Took a turn, took a turn um, out of an operation a couple of weeks ago. And now I'm recovering, and I've recovered enough to do things for an extended period of time and multiple things at once. So I am, you know, since I'm not at work, I've got plenty of time to do other things. So might as well bump a few videos up been that long, I can't remember what we were doing last time. So let's find out. Tutorials pop back up. Let's check our journal. So what were we doing? Oh yes, objectives. So I'm just going to put... I actually wanted to just go to Port Cecil. And find the father's bones. Stars float in the mirror light, light of the waves. Watch them a while. But we're tearing all the 75. Now I think we'll, uh, hmm, we'll get something bad for that. So let's not. Is there a shop here? No, there isn't. So let's check the map. Oh, oh, that's not the map. That's a map. Ah, yes, I think we were just exploring. So to get us back into things, I think we'll go straight down. Watch. Oh, we're we heading along the top. I think we'll we'll carry it on along the top. Peaceful sailing of sunless sea. Dramatic music. A hiss of horror from the lookout. The glim lamp at the front of the ship is sputtering and arcing, fizzing with blue light, even as you watch the blue flames. But it's not a good omen. So spin them a story. So we don't have that. Attempt to calm them. 64% chance. Oh, got to do it. 
Light meets dark. The darkness underneath is more than the absence of light. It's a physical presence which distorts the shape of the world. Your light melts the darkness, restores sanity to the world. Your explanation... You explain something of this to your Zaylas, but it's not the first time you've heard it. But they seem slightly less nervous. So we've succeeded the heart's challenge. And I've got the fragment. This is very dramatic music. Send the bat out to have a look. So Mount Palmerston to the southeast. That's the source of this dramatic music. Volcanic island. Volcanic island, which gives us good prices on fuel if memory serves. It's the same with tutorials, we're not that. So Mount Palmerston, brimstone, always brimstone. You can go up the crater. I'm going to Mount Palmerston. So go to Mount Palmerston first. So sullen lights glow green at the jetty's edge. Behind the port buildings, the island is knee-deep in ash. There are ruins here and there of houses destroyed by fire. Fire above the mountain's top flickers red, just for an instant. So take note of a veiled woman. Unfortunately, we can't do that. So a middle-aged woman in a veiled hat is staring at you, waiting for you to notice and listen to her. Oh, we need a submarine for that. I have no idea what that is. Unlocked with... Eigel, commissioned to retrieve a regret no more than zero. Um, unlocked with under the Untersee. So engage an officer. Nope, we don't have any of that. I yeah, don't really want to do that. So we'll grab the port report. So there was a revolution in hell and the aristocracy of devils fled here. Here they plot an exile. So we get the port report. Explore the island because we've got this something awaits you. The vista. The Z opens out beneath the high cliff. Rip it. The high place. The Z like a rippled sheet of night green jade. The roof beneath above. Bellied with statics and pricked with false star. Look out across the water. What are you thinking of? Your future. From here, your future looks glorious, if not exactly bright. Your past as a soldier. For the years before you came to see fighting enemies of the reduced empire, losing good friends in the marshy borderlands of hell. We'll, we'll try that one. New victories. In the army, you serve men too rich to fight and only too, stu and too stupid to leave you alone. Out here, you are the only commander. The ship is your own empire. You've never felt stronger. So I've gained five iron. I can shoot things better. So, Mount Palmerson. Anything else for us? Nope. Shops. Fuel. See, very low price for fuel. Buy a, buy a couple. So, supplies are a bit on the expensive side. But that's really to be expected here. So, let us vacate Mount Palmerston and carry on east. Played it for a while. <laughs> Bop. So, Port Cecil. 
sure that should be somewhere to the south now, so let's go down and head back towards London. Oh, I forgot that was pause. Oh, this one again. Burning blue, same one, so I'm not going to read it out. So I succeeded once again. I think we'll turn the light on this time. Send out the bat. We can't dock there because we don't have a submarine. Or a submarine. Oh, we watch for fungal pads in the Sea of Lilies. There is a prison here guarded by not oracles. I think that's where our chef guy wants to go. Oh, oh, staying away from that. Light off. Slight. You kind of just you want to stay away from as many creatures as, and ships as possible when you've just got the starting ship. So, dock. Wisdom. Nup Mid built this place as a prison for the Canate. So Nup Mid built this place as a prison for the Canate, now it answers only to its governor. Its governor answers to no one. Let the Shady Cook go ashore. Walk over. Just, I can't pronounce that, it says dangerously. Let me sit. Yes, the unctuous fellow assures you we value enthusiasm over formal qualifications. The not oracles are always hungry, but they're also delicate in their taste. Their meals must be prepared assiduously. I believe that's what that says. I understand this fellow is indentured to you. Well, we have collected tremendous stores of knowledge from the oracles. Tremendous. Let me give you some of my notes, and we'll of course replenish your stores. Thank you so much. The cook darts eagerly into the prison, and as soon as doors are open, as soon as the doors are opened, he doesn't even say goodbye. So I've lost the cook. I've given five supplies. I've given five fuel. I've given one secret, one strategic information, five tales of terror, five sea stories, five memories of distant shores, five visions of a surface, and one moves in the great game. Those are you get quite a bit for that. So wisdom. There's not really much we can do there, but we'll compile a port report and leave the island. I've got enough fuel that I will uh, leave the light on now. So we're going to head back towards London here. Oh great, one of those uh, sharks. Those sharks are horrible. Do a hell of a lot of damage to you. So, doing your cruise quests generally get you gets you quite a bit of uh, bits of goodies. It's going to be really good when we get back. I don't think it'll let you get a... let's just get another one. So Sea of Lilies to the southwest. There we are. Turn the lights off so I don't attract that shark. There we go, discovered it. 
that is actually a giant frog there. It's almost as big as the ship. Oh, looks like we've got an island over here. So what have we discovered? Station 3. Depot A. I think it's worth saying. Stop in here. So look. Station 3. Machinery hums behind high steel walls. Machinery hums behind high steel walls. Up the hill there are visible outlines of warehouses and a building with a spire. But the lamps are low where they burn it. Burn it all and your ship the only one in harbour. So train your telescope on shore. Might be best to look from a distance. That. A church or something else. You stand on the high points of your ship and look to shore. There is a steeple building on the horizon, by far the largest thing in sight. No cross marks on top, marks on top of it, nor any other symbol you recognise. Poor report. So try the gate. The only way past the walls is an unimposing but sturdy looking gate of triple barreled silvery metal. Triple barred silvery metal. The sign beside it reads delivery. No way in. The metal is steel hard and icy cold to the touch. Attempts for chills and crow's bars fail. Perhaps we can bring the ship's gun to bear, but no. If you return with a certain delivery, the gate will be open. You'll know when you, you'll know if you find it. Dun dun dun. Uh, no shops. No shipyard. And let's just depart. Back west we want to go. Nothing. It's very piratical, this music. So I might be... Is it Port Cecil? Don't think so. Abbey Rock lies some distance to the north. Let's mark it on the map. There it is. We'll go there. Oh, straight up. Discovered the Sisterhood. Shepherd's Wash. The secret secrets, if you remember, is what you used to level up with and level up your various skills. West of Gredden's Fire. Oh, it's an actual White House. Twitter star, wherever that is. Rocking. So, Abbey Rock. Black spit of an island, far from anywhere anyone would want to go, and that's how the sisterhood likes it. Here stands their fortress com convent. There are bear traps that look friendlier than this. So, trade supplies. Resources are limited on this bleak rock, but the sisterhood will pay a fair price for supplies. And it's a good price, mind. So, 20 echoes to be precise. Now I'm going to keep my surprise. Compile a port report. We'll do that. Nothing is happening. The sisters watch as we feel their eyes. The sea crashes on the rocks. Withdraws. The fortress stands stolid as a last year of a century. The greatest peril you risk here is a certain purpleness of prose. Do we have a gift? No. Knock on the iron side of the gates, although you have no recent news. No, they won't let us in. Watch the con convent. Um, yes. Like huge and deadly herons assist this stalk among the very tops of the walls. You watch through a spyglass as they leap and whirl, slashing at each other with a variety of frightening weapons. 
God, one of them just turned a somersault. Oh, we got some some fragments for that. Some shops, and let us be on our way. in fighting it, so I'm just going to move away. Hope it loses sight of us. Gets bored. There we go. So, let's see that. What do you find? No islands. Let's head in this direction. to Gators more and then on to London. There we are. And there's a little dock area. Dock. So Gators more. I think we've been here before. The moon is a stalagmite, vast as a crag, and its foot is no safe harbours. The course of the citadel nestles halfway up. An intricate system of winches takes a strain, and your ship rises slowly from the sea. A whole creaks in protest. Grizzled sailors groan and cling to stanchions. Higher, higher, now the undersea shimmers like glass below. Children clambering, crevices cheer and wave alarmingly. The winch motor slows, and you hang in a cradle next to a red bow, bow pirate cutter. That. I'm going to do that. No, we're not going to do that. I don't really have much we can do here. Yeah, that could go horribly wrong. I think the shops. Shipyard. Nope. Right, let us leave and head back to London. Of course, it'd be a huge rock in the way. So 
the lights of London welcome you home, the story that only appears when you've been at sea for a little while. So a breath of relief. As soon as the gangplank touches the quayside, the terrors of the deep sea lighten. Walk tall, a smile more readily, but what dreams may claim. Terror is always reduced to 50 when you return to London if it is higher. If it is higher. However, if the terror is higher, you may suffer nightmares later. So the terror has gone down to 50. So collect messages from the harbour master. So clatter of the song of the dark side as soon as the soul. Other messages for you. Something has changed. Sound sense of business on the dock. The blind bruiser. Free evening. A little proposal. Good evening, Captain, and what a marvellous evening it is, if you don't mind me my saying so. And given it is my impression you're an obliging sort, I imagine you will not mind at all. And since you're so very, very obliging, perhaps you would mind, wouldn't mind making this little detail via Mount Palmerston with a few articles of cargo if you happen to be in the area. The interior man will of course cover your expenses for this trifling inconvenience. One unit of space, which I think we have. No, I will accept it. We so kind to deliver this little gift to our friend Emil Palmerson, and they will see you we get to hear about it. And when you come back, we'll cover your expenses. Bon voyage is my aunt. Was French by birth, if not by inclination, used to, used to like to say. Yeah, we know I'm old palms have been, we've already been there. So, one crate of unstamped, brilliant souls. Consider a specialist surgeon. She, she is staying at a respectable boarding house near the docks and has made it known she is available for work. I specialise in amputations, easy to acquire and wanted to appendages at sea. The talents could be well employed on your vessel. Calderier is a doctor who increases hearts and iron. Do we have a doctor? No, we don't. Only 30 echoes. We're signing her on. Welcome aboard. She comes with a bag full of knives and her own personal sharpening stone. Don't touch these, don't let anyone else touch them. Apart from new officer put your new officer by dragging her from the officer's tab to a slot on the top of the screen. Do this in port, not at sea, or you may unsettle your crew. So officers. So surgeon. Go, so back to story. Let us check. Hold. Mm, got some space. Okay, so. What should we do? The alarming scholar. Sell a lot of things through. So I'll send the out sell the out the outlandish artifact. So we've got quite a bit there. Hmm. Tell me the sea story. <laughs> Ten echoes. Z story. Z story. Z story. Z story. Memory of distant shores, we'll sell him that. Ten echoes again. And all done. Pass on some strategic information. Yes, we shall. Lots of echoes. Ooh, 
speak of moves in the great game. Let's do it. No, oh, that didn't get you much. Hmm. Do we still have... Yep, still got the port sessile on. So back to the Admiral. And submit the port reports. So Hunter's Keep. Only five echoes and a fuel. Mount Palmston. 40 echoes, not bad. Fenderbite. 10 echoes. Station 3. 100 echoes. Abbey Rock. 20 echoes. Taking a lot of fuel with this. Chapel of Lights. 20 echoes. Avid Horizon. 10 echoes. Oh, beeping noise is a timer that we're out of time, so I'll quickly sell the rest of these. I don't think we've anything else to do. No, I don't want to do that yet. So, lodgings, one paper. Rest for a bit. Just lost some terror. Back to the rest of the city. Some carousel docks. Lost five terror. Is there anything else we can do to get rid of Terra before I end this? Is it Rose's Wharf or Locked? London. Hmm. Lodgings. Rest again. Set yeah. the shipyard. Echoes for that. Is it the cutter? Or? No, it's not the cutter. It's this thing that we want the Corvette. 3,000 Echoes. Shops hold. And with that, I will call it an end here. So thanks for watching and be good to each other. Hopefully, we'll do a bit more next time. I'll have a few scheduled to go up over the next few weeks. Bye bye.